Well, Charlotte's underserved corridors of opportunity are seeking solutions to crime across the city, and now they're using the Charlotte Symphony to bring music to local neighborhoods. Yeah, the goal is to give people the opportunity to engage in music like they never have before. WCNC Charlotte's Anna King shows us how these, uh, this music to the ears of some here. The symphony CEO told me they would go to each corridor giving performances that represent each individual community. And those who attended today's event told me they're excited. The Charlotte Symphony held a celebration. And they cut the ribbon and they talked a lot. they're hitting the road for the first time. With invites from different corridors of opportunity, the symphony will travel on a customized 40-foot trailer to provide free concerts and music right at your disposal. We're really hoping we can showcase the vitality of every neighborhood. And our goal is to present music that's unique to each neighborhood. Hey guys, Congrats. how are you? <laughs> nice to see you. Thank you. Each concert will be tailored to the specific corridor they're performing in. The city says this has been a request from many in the city. You talk about the ones who were there prior to gentrification, this was not ever considered. So you talk about the people who come from those type of neighborhoods and the impact that it can have, positively opening their eyes to a very diverse music form. You like it up there? Yeah. <laughs> Diverse music you'll now get to enjoy right from your front porch. The first concert is scheduled for April 28th and the symphony CEO says anyone wanting to have this in their quarter can simply call them or reach out to them online and for information on how to do that you can head to our website at WCNC.com. But for now here in Uptown, Anna King, WCNC Charlotte.